Hey guys, it's Rob, and uh, as you can see, I brought out the uh, the skeleton crew. We're going to be uh, doing some decorating this year, and uh, we're going to start with these guys. I mean, it's and the dogs are going to help. Thank you, Piper. <sighs> so what I want to do with them is I want to try and dress them a little bit more. Uh, you know, it's like you can tell there's a couple different kinds here. These have got darker eyes. These have lighter eyes, but they have LEDs, little tiny baby teeth. These teeth are a little bit bigger, but, you know, they're not anatomically correct by any means. But they don't need to be. You know, they're Halloween props. Um, but what I want to do is take some cheesecloth and dye it so that it's a little more earth tones and maybe some creepy moss and things like that make them look more graveyardish uh coming up from the ground grim reaper you know spooky ooh spooky and uh i'm gonna start that tonight all right so here's what i got i got right now five packages of cheesecloth these are four square yards i've got a couple of leftovers of some wood stain and some acrylic paints, green, brown, and a couple black, because it's always fun to mix. All right, you can't see them all, but I've got five piles here of lovely, lovely cheesecloth and leftover stain. And this is uh, driftwood. This is actually a fairly light gray color. It's always easier to add color. Quite as easy to take it away once it's on. Oh yeah, and gloves. Oh good, look, mess. Mm. One of the nice things. Mess. Still a lot of uh, white in here, but that's okay because we're not done yet. It's always kind of fun because wipe up the spills with your work product. Stay in the table. I don't care. This table has seen a lot of craft use. I'm going to try the Sedona Red. It's a little darker color than the uh, American Oak or whatever that is. And it's a little, a little redder. It's still just, it's still very wood color, very natural. idea of how it looks when it's on the skeletons. Or just, you know, hanging around as decoration. <laughs> I'm just going to let these dry overnight and then we'll go back at it tomorrow. But I figured I'd bring you along for at least some of the craftiness. <laughs> 